guys and welcome to this episode of the Power Mechanic Simulator. Um, I have literally sold every single car I had, well standard car as well as DLC cars, and I have replaced all of them with mods. All these vehicles are on my mods, mod list, I say mod list. Um, they're all on Steam, you can find them, they're nice and easy to find. Um, yeah, I ended up with about, I think it was 2.7 million, and I spent the whole lot on them. Um, I have done a little bit of work, I did do a Morgan three-wheeler just before starting this video. Um, as well as done a little bit on this, I still got to do the engine wheels and all that crap on the Morgan Free Wheeler because the wheels, um, the I suppose it'd be the dimensions of the actual tyres itself was a bit uh, well, it was 91 by 80, which um, is a very weird size, and you can't get it. Lovely, all oh, that's nice and solid. Alright, yeah, in today's video is going to be starring this lovely, lovely, gorgeous vehicle, a DB4, um, yeah, DB4 GT Zagato, however you want to pronounce that. But yeah. Very nice looking engine. Uh, in this video, it is just going to be exterior and stripped down. Other than that, uh, the next video will be sort of like the engine and um, assembly and testing. So, here we go. Oh, yeah, one other thing I did forget. Um, I sold everything out of my inventory, and I mean everything. I've only got a few items which are from uh, the Morgan Free Wheeler, as well as accidental purchases for that as well. Certain things I have uh, bought and replaced, such as uh, the springs, front shock absorbers. Okay, that's that stripped down. Um, I've kind of repaired everything as well as you saw. Um, so it's just time to start putting it back together. But I've got to say, Aston Martin, who doesn't like an Aston Martin? 
I say DB4, very sexy. DB5, even sexier. Okay, it looks like I need quite a bit when it comes to the doors and stuff. Um, right. Ah, bollocks. So both of those broke already. That's broken. Damn. Okay, let's go to the rear. Yes. Fuel tank. Yeah, I did buy a load of fuel tanks as well. And bushes. that failed. It's not a good sign. Yeah. Hmm. Not good at all. So most of the major parts I need. Right, that's a rear D. Don't worry, I'm not going to torture you with me going through and getting all these parts. Like it's going to be quite a list. I'll see you when I've got them all. Right, I've got uh, most of what I need, I believe. And, uh, good. Ah, oh, bollocks. I know I should have bought some of them. arms and bushings but I do have a little bit more for the rear end so I'll check that on quick yeah need bushings need rear yeah so I need the upper Suspension. Oh, no, two even. Right, and a pup load of uh, bushes. Yeah, That's what I do when it comes to bushes. Sorts those out. Um, ah, oh crap, I think it was three I needed. Uh, rear axle covers, I needed them. I've got everything this time. Oh, uh, buying 50 was probably a bad idea. That's causing a little bit of uh, game lag. Some wearers having to load all that in. Right, I've got to do the rear shocks. They always look funny. Bees. Ooh, that's bad news. I haven't even done the front yet, so I'm going to need uh, a few more um, brake discs. Maybe I shouldn't have sold all of my inventory. I did get like 76 grand, so that weren't too bad. That was a couple of my cars. Right, 
Okay, looks like I did forget that. No, actually, I bought the wrong thing for that. Never mind. Right. So that's the majority of it done. So I just need the front parts. Got the brakes on this side. I think I'm right in saying I'm going to need more brake pads. So, uh, time for another quick cut. Get rid of um, these uh, bloody thingies. Uh, brake pads, that's what I wanted. I'll go for quite a few. Right, I'll be back one sec. That don't look right. There's no connecting rods, um, sway bar arms, whatever they're called, to uh, the sway bar. But right, just a few little bits in here that I can add. Oh, brake servo shot. What about the radiator? Radiator A. Does that mean I will need a bloody thing before it? buy that just in case and it was a break so though I required there lovely yep I was right oh no I was in B bastard Right. That's a lot of it done. And just got the I six to do and the tires, but those can wait till the next episode. Um next bit can be uh ah redoing the exterior so I need community come on load up froze a bit um, DB4 there we go right I need a left door left window Right window. Uh, I'm assuming that. I'm assuming that. Ah, fuck! I'll just get everything. I don't think I had bonnet. The hood. All right. That was expensive. But it is worth 628,000, which is a pretty penny. Alright, headlight. No. They can go. They just made it look fucking cheap. we go. I gotta say I do like the colour already. Right, 
it go? Oh my god! 600,000 was. It's now 1.2 million. I've got a second one of these sitting in the carriage as well. Oh good, they've got the steering wheel on the correct side. Yeah, I wonder how many people are going to be annoyed when they watch this. <laughs> Sorry, as you might have guessed, I am English and we drive on the correct side. <laughs> oh, that is going to cause some flack. Um, right. What seats was it? I am not even sure. Um, it was the flat backed ones, it was these. Seat 9, 2 of those and it was a wooden steering wheel that one steering wheel three I oh, know it is this typhoon steering wheel Fucking massive. That's probably why they went with that one. Um, Typhoon. Uh, was the Typhoon one? Yeah, it's not so much in the driver's face now. Still the same size though. Let me know what you think in the comments. Whether this car is sexy or what. That's a bit of a glitch there. Aston Martin DB4. Zagato. If whatever. <laughs> Alright, hopefully you'll join me on the next one where I will strip down and rebuild the engine. Obviously I'll add a bit more horses to it. Modernise it somewhat. And I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching.